Tonight we can report a fresh start for a dog horribly injured when he was dragged behind an SUV for a couple of miles. When we first introduced you to General Ben back in October, vets told us that he had some of the worst injuries they had ever seen. Well, tonight and only on 13, we're there when he gets a new family. To watch these dogs run and play is to watch two healthy, happy animals. But for one, it hasn't always been this way. He had wounds everywhere. I mean, both shoulders, all four feet, both knees. Ben, or Gentle Ben as he's known, was the victim of horrific abuse. There was definitely a time in the beginning when many of us were concerned um, that he wasn't going to recover from this. Let's go. The three-year-old pit bull was dragged behind an SUV, suffering injuries over much of his body. But that was three months ago. He is just a healing machine. This guy, he just, he started healing and he just went crazy with it. You ready to go, bud? Now Ben is practically bandage free. Yeah, buddy. Veterinarian Mark Petersman cared for him at work and fostered him at home. I love you forever, okay, bud? I do. So today is bittersweet. I love you. I do. The day Ben gets to go to a new Come on. Where you go? permanent home. Who's that? Is that Ben? I know it's your buddy. I know it. A very happy day, absolutely. Come here, Holly. With his new mom step and full-time playmate Olive. Oh. <laughs> the journey made possible by Every Dog Counts Rescue which paid thousands of dollars to cover medical bills. Just because a dog has maybe had a sad past doesn't mean it'll have a sad future. So it's, um, it's, it's, it's always inspiring, you know, to kind of see where they've come from and where they end up. In this case, tragedy has turned into something truly special. It broke my heart to see what had happened to him. And I felt like if we can make a difference in this cool guy's life, I, you know, we really want to. Let her, <laughs> let her run, bud. A dog who has seen a lot but more than anything, Hi, to go to your new home? this story is about love Beep. and Ben's new home. He, we call it dog paradise and he'll love it. <laughs> you have to meet the rest of the farm too. Will be his happily ever after. All right, come on off. Jeremy Brilliant, Channel 13, Eyewitness News. Thank you, Jeremy. The original dog owner is not charged in the case. Investigators say the driver didn't know the dog was tied to the SUV until they were pulled over by police.